Comic-Con, Comic-Con, uh, Comic-Con, Comic-Con. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is up, everyone? My name is Law, and I'm here with AMC Theaters and the one and only Greg Sipes, a.k.a. Beast Boy, because what are we doing today, Greg? What's up, party people? I'm being transformed into Beast Boy, the real-life Beast Boy. Yeah, Here's yeah, the other yeah. real-life Beast Boy right here, Wingman G. Sipes, the guru of the guru, the highest form of life on the planet. And we're going to have some fun. Yes, absolutely. Now, Greg, you have done Beast Boy for how many years now? Almost 18 years. Almost 18 years. Before most of y'all were born. Man, have you ever had a suit this slick before? No, this is definitely the slickest Beast Boy suit I've ever had. Yes. And look at these boots, yo. Oh, man, you were Comic-Con ready. What? Comic-Con ah. ready. That's right, we're here in San Diego for Comic-Con 2018. Very exciting time, but even more exciting is that Greg has a big movie coming out. Yeah, Teen Titans Go to the Movies, coming out July 27th in theaters everywhere at AMC Theaters. Go check it out. Get that A-list. See it. See it three times a week. Yeah, if you a, want to. a lot of my friends say, "Yo, I'm gonna go to AMC theaters like 13 times to see the movie. Go 14, all right?" Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now and gonna... actually, wear cosplay. I've been telling a lot of people, yeah. if you wear cosplay to the theaters, everybody's gonna want to take a photo with you. Mm -hmm. Actually, one of my first cosplays ever was Beast Boy. Oh I, yeah! I did the whole green. I did the spandex. It was uh, it was very revealing. That's but what's up. Also very powerful. It's nice. Now. Greg, I'm gonna leave you to it. We have our wonderful makeup artist today. We Kenneth, Kenneth Alexander, come on in. Yay! All it's right, Kenneth. all right. Amber Tellerico. <laughs> now they are experts at what they do. They're gonna make this man lean, mean, make me green. beautiful, y'all. Make me beautiful. It'll be very beautiful, and I will be a disembodied voice. So if you guys have any questions for Greg Sipes, or put Wingman, them in the or, or Wingman, or Wingman. G, any of them. Yes, the real life Beast Boy, right here. Let us know in the comments, and we'll feel them over to him. You're gonna be mic the whole time, so you can talk to him. Talk to Beast Boy. This is it. This is your chance. But I'll be back later. You guys get started. What's I'm up, y'all? Talk I'm to excited. me. I'm excited. You guys have fun. All right. <laughs> of course. It's so funny. The moment we go live, they start sawing. Keep it down! <laughs> Trying to transform into Beast Boy over here. <laughs> Throw him 50 bucks. We got some questions, Sharma? Yeah, we got a lot of people just saying hello. Hello. Uh, Beast Boy is the best from Edward Sanchez. Thanks, yo. Make sure you go see the movie. July 27th in theaters everywhere. And today, <laughs> we're actually, if you're at San Diego Comic-Con, we're doing two screenings, yo. Ooh. You have two screenings, one's at noon and one's at two, I That's heard. right. If you can get in, if you can sneak in, do it. Do it. Make it happen. Now, we got a lot of people Otherwise, actually... go to AMC and you can watch it there. As many Perfect. times as you want. We got a lot of people coming in from Comic Con saying that they're waiting in line watching this. That's exciting. Wow. You got Stephanie saying, "What's up?" All the way from Houston, Texas. What up, Houston? Yeah, yeah. Um, Houston in the house. Edward Sanchez says, "Beast Boy, I can't wait to see the movie." Ah. Now Terry Wilson has a very interesting question. Now you're a voice actor, Greg. You've been doing it for a while. They want to know what your real voice sounds like. Yo, this is my real voice right here. <laughs> Yo, man. Yeah, you know. Yeah, this is my Beast Boy voice. <laughs> this is my kind of like, you know, surfer dude California voice, you know, my regular like Venice Beach voice. And this is my real voice. <laughs> so, Amazing. Yeah, you know, that's what's up. Dylan wants to know, how are you? You're going um, green, but how are you as a, as a being right now? It's pretty easy being green, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I love the color green. It's the color of the heart chakra. It's a healing color. It, uh, it just makes you feel good. It's my color of my favorite food, salads. Salads is your favorite food? Yeah, well, yeah, actually. Yeah. Superfood salads are my favorite food. And the greener, the better. I throw spirulina on all my salads, which is a blue-green algae. It's an algae yeah. And I love kale. Green, green, green. I drink like three green juices a day, so I'm surprised I'm not naturally just green all the time. <laughs> um, Luis says, where's the waffles? Waffles, 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 waffles. You know, I wrote that song with Kari Payton, uh, who plays Cyborg, and um, it was so fun. They, they basically put a word on the piece of paper in the script that just said waffles, and they're like, come up with a song. 
And we came up with waffles, 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 waffles? Now, waffles, waffles. Oh man, Brody Cole is gonna be so stoked because he wanted you to sing that song. You got it. Let's see. Oh, Nanny, not Nani says, we got our tickets for Friday showing at 11 a.m. My son is already super excited. That's what's up. Now, we'll how, see you at the theaters, yo. How long have you been doing Teen Titans Go now? Teen Titans Go, I lost track of time, but it feels like <laughs> maybe like five years. Wow. Five years, I don't know. I'm a nowist. <laughs> I only believe in the now, so. But All it right. feels like a long time. And we've been kind of the number one show on Cartoon Network the whole time, which has been such a blessing. Millie Wood says, Wingman is so chill. Got Wait. a shout out to Wingman. Wingman. Also, Hiroshi. Wingman loves you all. Oh. Yeah. He's the cutest boy in the universe. Can he go green is the question. Wingman is, <laughs> yeah, he could. Actually, I was going to dye him with spirulina. Just pour spirulina powder all over him. Nice. Algae bath. Look how cool this, this uh, looks here. The screen, the AMC live. <laughs> broadcast screen looks nice. It looks like a movie theater screen. Yeah, it's looking a mini good. One. Greg, you do a lot of like acting outside of voice acting. Did you, have you done a lot of prosthetics and like makeup like this before? I have done some prosthetics um, on the show uh, Deadwood um, oh. on HBO. Very Kristen cool. Bell and I are actually reunited in the new Teen Titans Go movie. Ah, but so me cool. and uh, Kristen Bell starred in Deadwood together and we had prosthetics when we got beat to death. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so that was prosthetics with Kristen Bell on Deadwood, and what other? I've done it a couple times um, on uh, True Blood. I've been, I've had prosthetics, but nothing's as cool as turning into Beast Boy, yo. No, definitely not. Now Hiroshi Kitazawa says, watching from Japan. That's pretty cool. That's pretty awesome that they're all the way over there and they're tuning in to see you come. That's what's Beast up. Boy. Uh, let's see. Hey, who's got my phones, Aaron? Let me one see of, that bad boy, one, one of these guys does. Because I'm also, I took over DC Kids today. I want to make sure the DC Kids <laughs> channel's getting their love. Cross promoting with AMC Theaters, DC Kids. It's one big family, Cartoon Network, Warner Brothers Pictures. Now, Nani wants Super to Super News Live. They want to they wanna shout out for their sons, Ray, Ryan, and Roland. Yo, 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 Ray, Ryan, and Roland. Peace, love, and animals from Beast Boy. Yeah, yeah. Erin has a pretty funny question. She wants to know that, if do you get first dibs on any Beast Boy voice role? Do they come to you first? I would say they absolutely do come to me first, most of the time, and if they don't, then I, I, um, I find them. <laughs> and you don't want me to find you if you, don't, if you don't offer me a Beast Boy first. Trust me. I love that. Oh. Because I, you know, I'm the first actor to ever bring Beast Boy to life, so Beast Boy forever is a big part of who I am, um, and he's become me. So, uh, like even even the new uh, live action Titans show, I I kind of trained Ryan Potter to become the Beast Boy that he is, and he'll have his own version of it. But essentially, it's based on the Beast Boy that I created over the past 18 years, which is cool. Jose Rodriguez says, "What? There's going to be a movie?" So he didn't even know there was going to be yeah, Teen Titans. Yeah, Teen Titans Go to the Movies comes out July 27th in all the AMC theaters everywhere, yo. Now, without spoiling too much, what can you tell us about the movie and like what it's about? Well, the movie is about the Teen Titans saving the world in the most interesting, wild, crazy, unchained way possible. We got Will Arnett playing uh, Slade and Kristen Bell and your little Yachty and Nicolas Cage plays Superman. And if you like Easter eggs, the whole movie's an Easter egg. It's funny, it's crazy. And if you like season six of Teen Titans Go, maybe you should watch a movie. There might be a surprise for you. Ooh, we'll definitely have to touch on that later. And also, I think some people are gonna be curious about your, uh, your train, your Beast Boy training. So we'll probably ask you some questions on that in a bit. Yeah. Um, but we got a lot of people who have met you at like Salt Lake Comic Con. Uh, Millie said she met you at Denver Comic Con. What up, what up, Denver Comic Con, Salt Lake City Comic Con. I was just at uh, uh, Supercon in South Florida, which was so fun, because that's where I'm from. So it was a nice homecoming, and everyone's just so ecstatic to go see Teen Titans go to the movies. I've never seen, uh, so many excited people, and especially the youth, the kids of all ages, you know? Yeah. It's for all of us. Emily is wondering, actually, what kind of breed Wingman is. I know there's, like, actually a really interesting story about how you 
how you found him. So. Well, Wingman is a baby golden dragon. Uh, he was dropped off by these angelic storks from uh, the baby golden dragon planet. And now he rescued me. He was at the South LA Kill Shelter. And um, they were gonna kill him the next day, which is a nightmare. So make sure you adopt dogs, adopt cats, and become a vegan because all animals don't wanna be hurt. So that's why Beast Boy's a vegan, because I turn into every animal that's walked the face of the earth. So I don't wanna eat myself or hurt myself. And Wingman teaches me every day. He's the highest form of life on the planet. He's my teacher, my guru. The more I dedicate my life to Wingman, the happier, holier, the, and I find myself in the right place at the right time all the time with Wingman. Mwah. 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 We're getting some song requests. Oh yeah, what, what kind of songs you got? We got the What's... Tara song from Leo. Oh yeah, you want me to sing Fade Away? Now, the song Fade Away is the first song I ever wrote for Teen Titans Go. And Fade Away, um, I wrote it for Tara, really. And, uh, and then eventually in Teen Titans Go, I sang it for Raven and she got, she needed her own song, so I wrote BB Ray. Yeah. But uh, I'll sing you a little part of Fade Away. It can't fade away. The way I feel for you, there ain't no word I can say. What I do for you in every single day. I make it through this game called life. It's always full of pain and strife. Reality will cut you like a knife. It ain't right, but with you by my side, we'll win this fight in the battle of dark and light. Take my hand, hold it tight. When we dance, I feel all right. By your side is where I'll be. Endless love won't fail, you'll see. When I walk, you walk with me. Together, let the light shine. Yeah. Yeah. That's and then awesome. Raven got her own song called BB Ray, which is another song. People are asking, actually, what you think about BB Ray. Uh, are you for it? Is that a main show? I'm ship all about BB Ray all day. You know, my, my, one of my best friends is Tara Strong. She plays Raven. And it's, you know, it's something uh, that we kind of created together because our love for ourselves transcended into the cartoon world. So. You know, I wrote this song called BB Ray with my friend DJ Him, and it's a slamming song. It's all about my baby, yeah, it's all about Bay. And if I don't catch my baby, all I do is go cray, cray, cray. I love Mama Ray, yo. Now, Gunner wants to know what is your absolute favorite part about being Beast Boy? My favorite part about being Beast Boy is that I could turn into every animal. I think it's the coolest superpower you could ever have is to be able to turn into every animal there is because animals are the real superheroes. They're the, the highest form of life, they're pure love, and love is the fiercest and sweetest thing there is in the universe. Right, Guduji? Yeah. So turning into every animal is the best part of playing Beast Boy. And being green. <laughs> and being cute. <laughs> People are loving Wingman. They think he's a really well-behaved pup. He's saying Wingman he's super chill, all. super cute. He's the real life Beast Boy all the time. Actually, Wingman is, uh, He's my acting coach for Beast Boy. Is that where you get all your mannerisms That's from? That's where I get all my mannerisms. <laughs> Look, we got the same ears almost. Look at that. Wow, at you guys that. are matching That's now. That's nice. Look at that, ear to ear. Look at that. That's nice. That's almost perfect <laughs> ear to ear. Wow. Stephanie is actually wondering what kind of cons you're planning to go to next after Comic-Con. Well, my, one of my favorite things to do is to um, go to Comic Cons all around the whole world. So I'm trying to almost go to a Comic Con every weekend. I know I, I'm going to Rally, I'm going to Connecticut, I'm going to uh, Orlando. Uh, I'm going to go just everywhere. I'm going to come to your city soon, yo. Salt Lake. I'm going to Salt Lake City Comic Con soon, too. Lindsay says, I love Greg. He's even cuter in green. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> Elizabeth Sanchez wants a hey mama from you. What's up, Elizabeth Sanchez? What up, mama? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Emily said, love having you at Supercon. Lindsay wants you to come to Atlanta. For yeah, a con. I want to come to Hotlanta. That's Hot. one of my favorite places. One of, my, one of the reasons why I love Atlanta so much is because Cartoon Network headquarters is there in, in Atlanta, and I love visiting Cartoon Network in Atlanta. I love you, Cartoon Network. 
Carlos is hoping you could get a, uh, he could get a shout out for CJ and Isaac. What up, CJ and Isaac? Beast Boy loves ya. Are you all gonna go see Teen Titans go to the movies? You are, I can see you shaking your heads. I know I am. You's all smart, yo. <laughs> Comes out July 27th in all the AMC theaters everywhere. Make sure you get your tickets and wear your cosplay too. Everybody in the movie theater is gonna take pictures with you if you wear your Teen Titans Go cosplay. I've been seeing so many great uh, Teen Titans Go cosplays at all the Comic Cons I've been going to. Maybe more so than any other cosplay, I see Teen Titans Go stuff, so it's really cool to see the different Teen Titans Go cosplay. One of my favorite Beast Boys that I've seen recently is uh, The Night Begins to Shine Beast Boy. Yeah, that's a really cool it's one. Fresh. Hey Mike, will you grab my phone from there? Now are you guys doing uh, oh, it's right here. a cast of Teen Titans joining you at, uh, at Comic-Con? Uh, you know, it's gonna be a surprise. I'm not sure really who's coming to the, the premieres today. I know at the premiere, will be there. we're actually premiering, um, we're actually premiering uh, at the Chinese Theater Ooh. on Sunday, which is gonna be a big premiere. I think Will Arnett, Kristen Bell, Nicolas Cage, all, all, all kinds of people there, Little Yachty, it's gonna be fun, yo. Kevin Wynn says, Beast Boy is my spirit animal, which is like all the animals, if you really think He's about it. He's my spirit animal, yo. <laughs> wow, wow. Hey, Mike, right. take this real quick. To shoot. Yeah. Thanks. We capture in time, yo. This is magical right here on mm -hmm. AMC Theaters. And thanks to Super News Live for putting all this together. Wingman G for being the best thing in the whole universe. And Teen Titans go to the movies, which is one of the coolest things that's ever happened to me. It's such a blessing. And I think you all are going to love it. If you like to laugh, you're going to like Teen Titans go to the movies, yo. We're getting a lot of hashtag meatball parties. Hashtag meatball. As long as there's vegan meatballs, yo. <laughs> vegan meatballs. Ooh, Emmett asked. I hope so. <laughs> Every time Beast Boy turns into a dog, I always say, please make him into, into Wingman. Draw a Wingman, please. <laughs> Jennifer oh. wants a shout out for her son Aiden, who's turning six after the movie comes out the day after the movie comes out. Happy birthday, Aiden. Have a great birthday party at Teen Titans Go to the Movies. Bring all your friends, yo. Have you all seen at the AMC theaters all the setups where you can ride the time cycles? It's fresh. I've seen so many pictures, it's so rad. Hiroshi wants you to come to Japan when you think you can make that happen. Yo, take me to Japan, yo! Our first movie was called Teen Titans Tokyo, where actually I sang karaoke in Japan, and now we got Teen Titans go to the movies where we're not in Tokyo, but it's gonna be cool. But I wanna come to Japan, yo, for sure. Jeff Sipes Look at all these says, people. Oh, Jeff Sipes. Greg's green makeover is a big improvement. Just oh. keep Wingman Golden. Aw, oh, thanks, Pop. That's my dad, Jeff Sipes, watching live on AMC Theaters. That's what's up. What's up, Pops? We love you. Wingman loves you. He misses his grandpa. It's actually my dad's favorite show. That's why I love Teen Titans Go so much is because our show is for kids of all ages. Show him that screen, yo. You get tight on it. Nice. <laughs> He's coming along. I just want everybody to notice how identical me and Wingman's ears are right now. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. What? Well, uh, 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 look at that. It's the exact same size, Wingman. They did it perfect. I got Wingman ears, yo. Look at that. Uh, it's exactly the same. That's so fresh, Wingman D. I'm almost as cute as you, pop up. Keep going, keep rolling. You can place that one on the, that's why it's got a tripod. You can put it down and hit record. We capturing time, yo. This is a magical experience being transformed into Beast Boy. Definitely the freshest Beast Boy cosplay outfit I've ever put on. Look at these shoes. Have you seen these shoes, yo? What, what, what? What, what, what? I'm gonna wear these every day. <laughs> it's 
So after this, we's gonna head over to San Diego Comic-Con and walk around the floor and talk to the people, yo. Boy. Yeah, if you all want to meet me as Beast Boy, head over to San Diego Comic Con and meet me where? Uh, we're going to be meeting outside of uh, the lobby of Hall B. We're going to meet outside of the lobby of Hall B yeah, at San Diego Comic Con. We'll probably have Greg tweet that out as well so that you, you can hunt him down. You won't be able to miss me, yo. <laughs> the green guy. The green guy. With the cutest boy in the whole world with me, Wing of these Sipes. <laughs> Ray wants to know, is your room just as messy as Beast Boy's room? Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. No, but I like, I like uh, keeping my temple clean. Healthy, happy, holy. And if you can do it for yourself, keeping your body clean and your room clean and your bed made, it just makes life more fun. <laughs> Ooh, we have a great question. Uh, Bella wants to know, what is your favorite animal? That must be a hard one and one that you get a lot. Yeah, my favorite animal, I love all animals, and trees are animals, and humans are walking trees. I love all animals, but I think, you know, dogs are my favorite. They're the highest form of life on the planet. I also love seagulls a lot, too. If I was going to be a bird, I'd be a seagull. They're just sea eagles. And I think they're the smartest birds on the planet, because you, know, you all know why? Because they hang at the beach all day, yo. More so than any other bird, more than any pelican, everything. Lindsay Michelle Johnson says, I want to rub his ears, but we don't know if he's, she's talking about wingman's ears. You want to rub my ears or wingman's ears? Here, that's I'll rub that's wingman's the real ears question, I think. Oh, his ears are the yummiest. I chew on them all day long. <laughs> <laughs> that's not very vegan. What's up, vegan? Yummy, Google. <laughs> yummy ears. All right. Oh, oh man, Melanie Davis is jealous of your kicks. She definitely needs a pair of those. Yeah, get your kicks. Get your Beast Boy kicks. <laughs> Can we get a shout out for Drew? What up, Drew? They also want to know if you're coming to New Orleans anytime. Oh yeah, I really wants to come to New Orleans Comic Con. A long time ago, we did a full on Teen Titans New Orleans Comic Con. It was all the cast. So I definitely wants to go back to New Orleans. But you know what, if you're, if you're in New Orleans, and you want to see Teen Titans, go to Teen Titans, go to the movies, July 27th in theaters everywhere. AMC Theaters got it. Coming in hot. Killing it. We're saying, Latricia Wiley says, Hello, I love you, Beast Boy, all the way from Fort Worth, Texas. That's awesome. I love you, Texas. Shout out to Ryan and Ray, if you can. What up, Ryan and Ray Ray? All day, day. <laughs> See how that ears come along. Oh, wow. What do you think, Wingman? We should do one ear of Wingman's green. <laughs> nah, he don't need to. He's the golden baby drag. He's the golden Wingman. He's the golden beast boy. Now, we, we got some questions. Someone keeps saying booyah in the comments, just like Cyborg. I have a booyah! Is your, you invented booyah kasha on the new Ninja Turtles, right? Well, yeah, yeah. On the, on yeah. the new Ninja Turtles, I play Mikey. And uh, yeah, I came up with the new catchphrase, Booyakasha, which means all glories to the Most High. Booyakasha! So I wanted kids all around the whole world saying, Booyakasha, which brings in love, which is the fiercest and sweetest thing there is. And all glories to the Most High means bringing the highest vibration into the now. So now kids all around the whole world are going, Booyakasha! As Michelangelo uh, has inspired them to do so. So it, you got Cyborg and Teen Titans saying Booyah. Yeah, so Mikey. I mean, I do give credit to Cy. Starting with the booyah, but I took it to the next level. Booyah kasha. Yeah, yeah. Sha na 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 na. Oh, Abby Garcia is saying, how much do you love veggies? As much as Beast Boy? I love veggies maybe more than Beast Boy. For real, I, I, just, I just love vegetables so much. And the greener, the better. That's awesome. You are what you eat. If you eat things that are alive, then you live. If you eat things that are dead, then you die. So eat the greens, cause they live, yo. Cassie says, you always bring your dog. That's true goals right there. Yeah, yeah, it's, I'm so lucky. I'm the luckiest papa in the world, whole world to have my wing D with me all the time. And if he can't go somewhere, I ain't going. So as long as I dedicate my life to Wingman, I'm always at the right place at the right time, and I'm having the best time ever. So Wingman is my guide, my spirit animal, my everything. 
burritos or burgers is a big question well, right now. Well, veggie bur vegan burritos or vegan burgers, veggie burgers? I mean, they're both goods, yo. As long as they veggie, as long as they vegan, but I don't know. Maybe I'm like a burrito man. Burrito. Are you all burrito? Are you vegan burrito people? Or vegan uh, veggie hamburgers? Yeah? What about you, wingman? You had a veggie burger yesterday, yo. Edward Palmer wants you to rap battle Tara Strong. I don't oh, yeah? know when, when that can happen. Maybe the next live stream on I don't AMC. know, maybe we can find Tara Strong over at the Comic-Con floor. Actually, we's gonna be with Tara Strong today for the sneak preview of the movies today, the premiere of the movies here at San Diego Comic-Con. So we'll be with Tara today, so I'll do a rap battle with her today. You got it. Oh, Jennifer Hallman White, her daughter is asking, her daughter December is asking if you're ever going to marry Raven. Am I ever gonna marry Raven? Well, I don't know, Beast Boy's got a lot of love. I love all kinds of mamas, so I don't know. Maybe, if she's cool with that. Cause Tara still got my heart. Oh, she broke my heart. This is a great question from Benjamin. He wants to know, what was it like to play Beast Boy and yourself in your 200th episode of Teen Titans Go? So cool to play myself and Beast Boy in the same episode of Teen Titans Go. There's a scene where we're actually, all the voice actors are in the recording studio at Warner Brothers Studio, and the Teen Titans Go team, Beast Boy, Raven, Cyborg, Starfire, everybody, Robin, everybody comes in, and we actually get to meet ourselves. It was really psychedelic and cool. And actually, that episode right now is up for an Emmy. Yeah, Teen Titans Go is up for an Emmy right now. We've been nominated for the Emmys for that 200th episode. So it's amazing what's happening for Teen Titans Go. We got our movie coming out on July 27th, July 27th in all the AMC theaters, and we just got nominated for an Emmy, so it's fresh. And we're making new episodes every week in the air on Cartoon Network, yo. Now, Leo is asking, any other voices on Teen Titans? Yeah, I do all kinds of voices on Teen Titans Go. Uh, one of my favorite ones is, there's a robot, uh, and he goes, hello. Hello, hello. I forget the name of the episode, but I get to do all kinds of fun voices. Oh snap, looking okay. good. Cool, my man. All right. What's up? Now, we have been doing this for a while. I think we're like near a halfway point. We got some right. finishing touches. We got to get your hair green and stuff. Right, right. But we wanted to talk to you a little bit about Teen Titans Go to the Movies yeah. a little bit. Okay. Is there a favorite memory from recording this? Because it, it's got to be a little different from doing the TV show. My favorite memory was the first recording session we had where all the actors were in the same room together and it was the first version of the script and when you're making a movie it goes through many versions of the, of the script. So that, that first time we recorded the movie was just so, just so like we were dreaming awake. It was so fun and funny and we're like, whoa, we're making a movie, yo! It was cool, I'll never forget that day. I feel like that, that line itself was in the trailer too. It did, like, yeah. Movie, yeah, yes. and I feel like a lot of the stuff from the first recording session of Teen Titans Go to the Movies actually made it in the movie. That's awesome. And that's one of the best things about our show is the energy comes across through the screen because we all love what we do so much. We love each other, all the actors. We love all the creators, the creative people, the producers and the writers. It's just a big love fest. It's crazy. It must be a huge family. You guys have been doing this for almost two decades now. That's right. That's insane. Almost 18 years playing Beast Boy, yo. That's amazing. I, I know a lot of people out there wouldn't know anything about Beast Boy if you didn't like help bring him into the light. Um, and the new live action Titans trailer just dropped the other day. Yeah, I saw that. It was pretty fresh. Was it cool seeing a, a live action version of, of a character that you you? I helped? mean, you're seeing a live action version of the character oh, right I now, was yo. Say. I was gonna no, but say. it's cool. I, I think the ti the live action Titans is gonna be cool, and um, and I've been honored to try to kind of uh, train Ryan Potter, who's playing the. Uh, Beast Boy and the live action Titans. I've been training him as Beast Boy for a while and he grew up watching the original Teen Titans. So cool. And he's a big fan of Teen Titans Go. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be cool. You should definitely watch it. I was gonna say, what goes into training to become Beast Boy? Like if I wanted to be, you know, a Beast Boy and uh, like if I wanted to cosplay at Comic-Con, what are some of the traits I need to like embody? Well, if you all want to train to be a Beast Boy, you got to just have fun. You got to be unchained, you got to be wild, you got to love animals, you got to love the color green, you got to love vegetables, even if you don't, dress up as Beast Boy and start eating your veggies and you's gonna like it, yo. Oh man, Greg, I don't like vegetables very much. Well, dress up as Beast Boy, get green, 
and you's gonna like the greens. It's All easy. Right. It just happens. It's I, I just have to. I just have to put my differences aside with yeah. vegetables and like really go for it. Yeah, stick I a think. carrot in your mouth. <laughs> now, do you have a favorite scene from the movie that you can like tease for us without without spoiling? I, I think one of my favorite scenes in the movie is probably it was in one of the original trailers where uh, Beast Boy turns into a porcupine and shoots uh, his spines at the big uh, balloon. That inflatable man. Yeah, and he farts for a while. Yeah, yeah, that was a good fart joke. Yeah. I'm always down for a good fart joke from time to time. You guys shouldn't knock it until you try it. <laughs> See? Hey. Hilarious. So good. <laughs> Watch out, bro. Now, we, we're gonna go see the movie today. There's two showings, right? It's noon and two. Yeah, noon and two here at San Diego Comic Con. Mm -hmm. But before that, like we said, we want you to come see Greg dressed up as Beast Boy. He's gonna be running around the floor at Comic Con. We're gonna be meeting outside of the lobby of Hall B inside of the convention center. So B for Beast Boy, remember that. Yeah, yeah, come hang out with me in front of Hall B at San Diego Comic Con. We're gonna cruise around the, the Comic Con floor and have some fun, yo. Oh, oh. <gasps> Oh, Guys, that's what's up, it's, it's happening. happening. Oh man, I'm also Beast Boy now. Fresh! Yeah! That's what's up! Oh man, now, this is gonna stay all Now you're just gonna love kale all of a sudden. This is permanent. Kale and broccoli, bro. This is forever. Forever, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, a good color green on you. Oh no, I like it, it's a good shade. Yeah, and if you like the original Teen Titans, I'm telling you, go see Teen Titans, go to the movies, because there's a real special treat in the movie for all you cats that love the original Teen Titans. That's awesome. Trust me. And I think after the premieres today, people's gonna be talking about it. I'm excited. Now, Maybe uh, season six is coming back? Is I don't know, do y'all want that? I don't think y'all want that. I need it, Greg. I need to find out what happens to Tara. I need to hap I need to know. Tara broke my heart, enough of her. <laughs> it's about all about Ray Ray. 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 Okay, I got you, I got you. Now we're gonna play the trailer for Teen Titans Go to the Movie so you guys can get a taste of what- Right now is you gonna play the trailer? We're gonna play the trailer, Fresh. we're gonna cut back and we're gonna finish this look and then we will see you guys at Comic-Con. I'm gonna get out of your hair for right now, see if this green spreads, if this uh, this virus spreads and I can turn into animals. We'll I think you just need some mulled green, bro. All right, well, we might have to do that. Mean green fighting machines, baby, that's what we are. Now, we're gonna go Teen Titans Go to the Movie trailer right now and we'll be back finishing Greg, becoming Beast Boy. Teen Titans Go to the Movies, <laughs> yo, at AMC! <laughs> uh. Beast Boy! Do you know what makes a real hero? It's not the costumes, the gadgets, the cool powers. It's having your own movie. And that has always been my dream. Uh, what are you doing? Just giving the people what they want. Our movie's not about Wonder Woman, it's about us, the Teen Titans. No one wants to see us, fool. Wonder Woman inspires people. And we do not. Uh, yes, Wonder Woman is great, but... I love Wonder Woman! Wonder, Wonder Woman! Woman. Wonder Woman. Uh, narrator guy, just do your thing. From the creators of Teen Titans Go. We are the Balloon Man. It's about courage. Titans Go! It's about action. It's the superhero movie to end all superhero movies. Hopefully. That wasn't a fart! <laughs> that was just air leaving my butt! Which is a fart. Teen Titans go to the movies. Because if Aquaman can get a movie, anyone can. Oh, we almost there. We're getting close, yeah. Getting closer. I can't see anything. <laughs> I can't see anything. Brian Moore has been asking you to shout out Red X for a while, but I remember your relationship with Red X being a little uh, less than friendly. Yeah, Red X is a punk. Red X, what you want to know about Red X? Who do y'all, who do y'all think Red X is? I got asked that a couple days ago. And for me, I can't tell you. I don't, I, know wanna, the behind I don't want to venture the wrong guess, but I think it rhymes with Mick Lason. <laughs> or Bobbin. Oh. <laughs> Maybe, who knows? 
Ooh, Lindsay Michelle Johnson also wants to know, how was it working with Carrie? Because that man is hilarious. Kari Payton? Kari Payton. I love working with my bro, Kari Payton, who's now one of the big stars on uh, The Walking Dead. He's King Ezekiel. And the cool thing about that is there's a lot of fan art of um, King Ezekiel with uh, Green Beast Boy Shiva. <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Yeah. There's a lot of Walking Dead, Teen Titans Go crossover fan art with Cyborg and, and uh, Beast Boy, yo. Jeannie is wondering if you could shout out to Scooter in Texas. What up, Scooter in Texas? Ooh, Hector Rodriguez has a really interesting question. What you got, Hector Rodriguez? He's, he's asked, what, in what ways are you similar to Beast Boy and Iron Fist, which is another character you voice? Well, all the characters I play on TV are very much big parts of who I am in just different ways. Like uh, Kevin Levin on uh, Ben 10 is kind of my darker, more dark humorous side. Um, uh, Iron Fist on um, Spider-Man in the Marvel Universe is, you know, my, my zen namaste side. And uh, Beast Boy is just kind of like the biggest part of who I am, which is all about the animals, all about the peace, the love and the animals, and uh, having a wild, fun, free time. And that's, how, that's just how I roll. And Beast Boy loves music. I love music. Beast Boy likes girls. I love them girls. I love them mamas. Beast Boy <laughs> likes uh, Kale. I love Kale. Beast Boy likes going to see Teen Titans go to the movies. You all better like it too. Now you's gonna like it. I don't even worry about that. If you like Salaf, you're gonna like Teen Titans go to the movies, yo. One of our young fans named Kenson is uh, his birthday is on the 27th. What do you think he should do on his birthday, Greg? If your birthday is on July 27th, you best be going to see Teen Titans go to the movies, yo, at AMC theaters everywhere. That would be a fun birthday party. I might even make my birthday July 27th just to change it up. From now on, my birthday is July 27th. <laughs> I'm going to have a big birthday party, big pizza party, vegan pizza party at the AMC theaters for the Teen Titans Go to the Movies premiere, yo. We could definitely make that happen, Greg. That'd Giant pizza party at AMC theaters, right? We could, oh, no? Okay, well, we'll have to, okay, we're gonna talk about it, okay. How's we doing on DC Kids there? What's up, family? He's multi-streaming. Multi-streaming. Beast Boy's got things to do. People we got see, things to do, to do, people to, to see. Spreading the love, green energy all around. Do you have any other pets, Greg? Actually, I just adopted two kitty mamas. Oh, yeah, congratulations. Yeah, I got two kitty mamas, and, um, One's name is Cookie, and the other one's Momster. Oh. Cookie and Momster. Cookie Momster. I love all animals, and I love kitties so much. Kitty Mama. One of my favorite songs that I have um, written and produced is a song called Ice Cream Kitty that uh, te on Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Michelangelo sings a, a song called Ice, Ice Cream Kitty that I wrote. It's That's slamming. Marlene wants to out. see more wingman, <laughs> but he looks like he's What do you sleeping. mean you want to see more wingman? He's right here, yo. Taking a little nap. -oo. Oh, he's oh. a little sleepy boy. He's a little sleepy boy. Jennifer is curious, how often do you find yourself singing The Night Begins to Shine? Because it gets stuck in her head all the when time. When I look at you, the night begins to shine. <laughs> I see you. I forget the lyrics. Oh, yeah, yeah, everybody loves the Night Begins to Shine so episodes. Funny. And I think there's something real special coming for y'all, all you Night Begins to Shine lovers out there. Ooh. Something real cool coming your way. I can't talk too much more about it. That's, a, that's a tantalizing little tease there. But again, if you like the original Teen Titans, there's something real special for you all in the Teen Titans Go to the Movies, so make sure you check it out. Jared's wondering, is this the first time that you've dressed up as a superhero before? What you mean? I'm always a superhero, yo. <laughs> now, nah, but this is my second time dressing up as Beast Boy proper. Super News Live uh, transformed me one time before, so it's cool to be doing it again. And it's even better this, this time. I think next year, though, I think you should transform me into an animal, a, a Beast Boy a animal. A Beast Boy mid-transformation? Yeah, like, yeah. Like going into a cat or something like Yeah, like, like half that? horse. <laughs> Half Beast Boy. That would be... Like a, what do they call it, a centaur? The centaur, yeah. A centaur Beast Boy. That would be quite a production. Or you could turn me into Amoeba. 
We'll start I've working on that I've been amoeba many times. Manila says they love you, Beast Boy. Mabuhay. I love you. In Manila, in the Philippines? In the Philippines. I love the Philippines. My home, my home. Actually, I was there last year for uh, uh, the Philippines Comic Con. Yeah, they want you to come to Toy Con. Yeah, like. Toy Con. Yeah. Shout out to Toy Con. That's where I was. Perseus with says, my boys thank at you Pop for Life. To a toy Con last yeah, year. Toy Con, yo. Amazing. Oh, Lindsay Michelle Johnson saying that she misses your version of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles so much. Booyah Well, it lives forever. It does. That was and a you cool know, series. if you want some second, third rate. TMNT, you can watch the new one. <laughs> Shots fired. Shots fired. Did they, are they going to dye your hair green and are you using contacts? I don't know what's going to happen. I just showed up. <laughs> I think we're going to do I a I didn't wig. even know this was going to happen. I was coming for the orange juice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And she no, said, yo, you want some fresh squeezed orange juice? So I came downstairs and then they do this makeup on me. <laughs> uh, we're getting a request for a high three. TMNT style. There High it is. three, yo! <laughs> Never done that before. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it this direction now. <laughs> and now we're Wait, being. Now they oh, that's a better. High, that's better. High three. That's good. That's, that's a good. better. High three. High, high three, booyah kasha! There it is. That's what's up. People always ask me, you know, what two characters would would you like to have hang out the most? And I think Beast Boy hanging out with Michelangelo would be fresh. Both huge parts of who I am. Oh, snap. It goes, oh, wow. It's a little tight. A little tight. I'm a loo- uh. <laughs> <laughs> they want you to become Mikey next year from Ninja Turtles. For, uh, oh, yeah? Well, maybe we could do, I could do Mikey uh, on Super News Live becoming. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Super News Live, we do like turning but today is all about Beast Boy, yo. BB. And Teen Titans go to the movies. <laughs> Coming out July 27th. I know you all know, but I'm going to say it. I'm going to say it again and again and again. Because I know you all going to love it. So go to AMC and watch the movie. Watch it like 15 times. Bring all your friends. Have birthday parties. Wear cosplay. Bring your dogs. It's a dog party. Oh, mug mug. Wow, you while you're doing this, someone is actually watching you as Beast Boy turning into a gorilla. <laughs> right now on oh, TV. Oh yeah? Am I on your TV at home? And I'm on your phone? That's cool. Transcending, yo. Beast Boy's <laughs> omnipotent. <laughs> yo, what up, Rory? Rory, you turned two years old? What's up, Rory? You turned two years old on the DC Kids Instagram. Who? What up, Owen? What up, Robin? Beast Boy loves you all. <laughs> wow, wow. And okay, I think you can all go watch this over and over and over and over again on the AMC uh, social media channels, right? Yep, yep. On the YouTube, on the Twitter, on the Instagram. Where else? Facebook. On yeah. Facebook. Live on all those Yeah, platforms. live on Facebook right now. And it'll live here forever if you guys and missed it. you can go see Teen Titans go to the movies at all the AMC theaters. So that's what's up. <laughs> can I get some water, yo? It's a lot of work for me. You could definitely do that. Thanks. Oh, uh, Wingman. Can somebody get Wingman a cup, please? Wingman is thirsty, too. I will pour this in there for him. Stay hydrated, yo. It ain't easy being green. I don't need no straw. Listen, kids at home, do not use straws. They wind up in turtles' noses and it turns into trash and pollution in the ocean. So this is a public service announcement. Do not use straws, get rid of them. Recycle them, make art out of them. No straws. Don't litter either. And she walked into her daughter's room and this was playing on her phone and her daughter woke up to your voice and says, that guy sounds like Beast Boy. Oh, what's up? Good morning, yo. <laughs> Good morning. I'm on your phones, yo. I'm on your computers. 
I'm on your TV screens. I'm on your movie theater screens, yo. It's so cool going to the movie theaters and seeing the Teen Titans go um, movie trailers at all the movie theaters. Everybody went to see like all these movies like, oh, there you go. The Incredibles, during The Incredibles, the Teen Titans go to the movies, promos played and everybody's like, I kind of like the Teen Titans go to the movies promo better than the Incredibles movie. Just the promo. Your promos for Teen Titans Go to the Movies have been hilarious, actually. Thanks, yo. Um, there's a lot of uh, a shade being thrown at like some of the more popular DC characters like Batman, Superman. Does that carry over in the movie a lot? I mean, if you like Batman, Superman, and all these DC superheroes, he's gonna love the movie because they all's in it. And we all, we just, we just clown and it's all shenanigans all the time. We have a good time. Yeah, I mean, you could call it shade or you could call it a bright light on humor. If you like laughing, you're gonna like Teen Titans go to the movies. <laughs> He was very thirsty. Yeah, hey, my boy. What up, Zell? I loves you. Wingman loves you. He's a thirsty boy. Oh, Wingman, you're the cutest thing in the whole world. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so important to stay hydrated, yo. Oh, we got a wingman cam right now. Just mm -hmm. all water all the time. Mwah. Wow, Wingy. <laughs> You're gonna take a long pee-pee. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Papa Sipes saying, that's pretty amazing that the makeup artist can do such a good job while Beast Boy says, that's what's up. Yeah, I'm pretty <laughs> impressed. These makeup artists are real professionals. You can put that water down, my sure. friend. Thank you. You feel better, Wingy D? You hydrated and happy? Good boy. So when we heading over to Comic Con, right San Diego Comic Con, to have some fun with the fans, right you're gonna meet me that. in front of Hall B. If you at San Diego Comic Con, meet me in front of Hall B, and we're gonna we're gonna entourage it around the Comic Con floor. Beast Boy entourage, yo. And then if you can make it to the premieres today, there's two of them. Teen Titans go to the movies premieres, two of them today at San Diego Comic-Con. Happy birthday, birthday Jaden. Jane Cooper in Oklahoma wanna what up, yo? What up, yo? Oh, snap. It's happening. Oh wow. It feels right. Blending in together. It just feels good. Gotta, <laughs> gotta maintain those burns. I just gotta turn my teeth on, have my fangs come out. <laughs> look, they're already starting though. If you look close enough, they naturally grow, up, grow out. <laughs> look, Wingman's got his already ready. You want to show him your tea for his wingy beat? No, he don't want to show you all right now. <laughs> he didn't get paid yet. <laughs> oh, uh, Jack, Lindsay's dog, is throwing a shout out to Wingman. Wingman's fans in the house. What up, Jack? What up, dog, Jack? Arf, arf, arf! Arf, 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 arf! Yeah, he gets it. That's a, arf, that, arf, arf, arf! That's definitely a look of arf. understanding there. What else you want to say to Jack, your dog fan? It's so cool when we're at Comic Cons all around the whole world. People bring uh, their dogs to meet Wingman. Wingman's got a whole, on, you know, fan base. Yeah, Wingman. Of is course, a, he's the highest form of life on the planet. OG Beast Boy, right? He's the hardest working dog in Hollywood, yo. Uh, can we get another shout out, but for Aiden? What up, Aiden? Beast Boy loves ya. And if you're watching all around the whole world, in France, in England, in Australia in Uruguay, in Brazil, in Philippines. We loves you, yo. Make sure you go see Teen Titans go to the movies at all the AMC theaters everywhere. Now we know you can talk in dog now. Yeah, yeah, can I'm you, talking dog. Can you say what up, yo, in tiger? Oh, wow. <laughs> I haven't spoke tiger in a long time, yo. I ain't spoke tiger in a long time. But you know what? I can speak waffles. Can y'all speak waffle? Waffle, waffle, waffle. Waffles, 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 waffles,
waffles. It can't fade away. The way I fit for you, there ain't no word I can say. What I do for you in every single day. I'm looking through this game called life. It's always filled with pain and strife. Reality will cut you like a knife. It ain't right, but with you by my side, we will win this fight in the battle of dark and light. Take my hand, hold it tight. When we dance, I feel alright. By your side is where I'll be. Endless love won't fail, you'll see. When I walk, you walk with me. Together, let the light shine. What about that song? I'm making that money, that pyramid scheme money. Making that money, that pyramid mummy money. Son. Well, again, I love all the animals, but I'd say I love, I think turning into a dog or a seagull is my favorite. And dinosaurs are cool. Marissa wonders, do you ever lose your voice from talking like that for so long? Do I ever lose my voice from talking like this? Um, sometimes when I do, you know, Comic-Con signings for six hours every day, and everybody's like, do the voice, yo! And I do the voice because I love you all. But then I ain't got no voice, so sometimes. Wow, we got another viewer what up, Jordan? Huh? Another viewer from the Philippines tuning in at 1 a.m. there. Philippines in the house. Salam My Nicole. island peoples, I love you. I can't wait to come there soon. Thank you, ma'am. For ToyCon. All right, which side do you want to choose? Which side? Well, I mean. Is it, is it this guy right I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> right? yeah. mouth a little bit more. I'm just gonna put some pressure. Just let it sit there for a minute. I had like my dentist. <laughs> oh yeah, I got our tooth in now. Are you sure it's on the bottom one? Mm -hmm. Really? Yo, what up, Celeste? <laughs> Ison says, can you go to Comic-Con dressed like this? I need pictures. Yeah, I'm going to be at Comic-Con. Go ahead. I ain't going to bite you. <laughs> Yeah, he'll be at Comic-Con dressed as Beast Boy. We'll be hanging out as Beast Boy outside of the lobby of Hall B. We'll be heading over there right after the stream is over. So if you want some pictures, video, just to hang out with Beast Boy, today is the day. Yeah, yeah. This is Beast Boy. <laughs> From West Hollywood. No, I love you, Zah. My sister made me a really cool rainbow uh, San Diego Comic-Con badge. We just got love for everybody, all races, all religions, all creeds, all animals, all trees, Mama Earth, and you. Beast Boy loves you. Ooh, lots of money. Yeah, we can stop this. Why don't you take a snapshot for the people? Bye, DC kids. I'll see you at the movies. Teen Titans go to the movies July 27th, yo. Hot pepper. Take a, snapshot a lot of people are saying me, hot pepper. Is that a song that you do on Teen Titans, Greg? Say share. Hit share. Oh, he's got he's got social media to deal with. But I'm still here, guys. <laughs> I can still see your comments. They really want you to sing something called hot pepper, Beast Boy. Actually, you can post that. Hit share. You can post that. But you know what looks cool? This is what they're all seeing at home. Take a picture of that screen, yo. I loves it. I love being green, yo. It looks like we're Put it in the feed, you know how to do that? We're gonna wrap up in a little bit. Gonna let Greg settle into the character, but like I said, if you are at Comic-Con, San Diego Comic-Con 2018 this year, come hang out with us in front of Hall B's yeah. lobby. We'll be there. And like maybe like half an hour in to an half hour. hour. Meet me at the Comic Con San Diego, yo. We got some fun. Especially if you're in Teen Titans cosplay, we absolutely want to see you there. Yeah, let's roll out. 
Let's roll out like a team. Teen Titans go to the movies. But we're doing a spin-off show today called Teen Titans Go to Comic-Con. Funded mm -hmm. by AMC Theaters. Lipstick on, you know? Nothing better than a nice full lip on a beautiful summer's day. This reminds me of your old hairstyle, actually. When you cut it short right after you yeah, had the long. Yeah, it's like that length. Yeah. Can you take a feed photo for me? Yeah. Put a little caption. Oh, another. I want the people to see the magic happening right here on AMC. I want everybody to go see Teen Titans go to the movies. Coming out July 27th in theaters everywhere, yo. AMC theaters everywhere, yo. I don't know. I don't know what you got going on, but no matter what you're doing all summer long, you best go see the movie. See it a whole bunch of times. Bring your friends, your family, have a pizza party. AMC Theater's got some good popcorn, I know that. Maybe we can do green popcorn. That would be fresh. First green time, popcorn. Green popcorn. You know what, you could bring your own like spirulina though. You bring spirulina to the AMC Theater's, pour it on your popcorn, make some green popcorn. You gotta get your own seasoning sometimes. Yeah, yeah. Totally get that. But that would be fresh. Make it happen, AMC Theater's. <laughs> green popcorn. Hector Rodriguez says, you look so dope. Greg Seifert. Thanks, Hector Rodriguez. Action. I love you, yo. Heck yeah. I feel dope. I look dope. I feel dope. I got Wingsman G Sipes here in the house. <laughs> we loving life. Jonas is saying, ah, my childhood is now rekindled. Back to life. Ah, uh, we a kid again. How about that? Your childhood, your, your childhood is back. You're a little child. That's kind of wild. It's funny because you do so many songs that are food related that in the comments it's just like waffles, waffles burritos, burritos, hot peppers, hot peppers, and burgers, veggie burgers, and then meatballs, tofu meatballs, guys. Tofu meatballs. What's your favorite episode of Teen Titans Go, yo? <laughs> favorite episode all of Teen Titans Go? All you all at home, what's your favorite episode of Teen Titans Go? I personally will always love Night Begins to Shine. I love When I look at you, I see the story in your eyes. John says you're definitely gonna lose your voice soon, but John, Greg's a professional. Yeah, he this is what this I do, living. bro. I ain't gonna lose my voice. This is my voice, fool. Come on. <laughs> Mario wants to know, if you've had green popcorn, have you tasted green ketchup before? Yes, I have. I like anything green. <laughs> All green, I like. Cool. All right, Greg. Yeah. You are pretty much done here. You're looking like Beast Boy. Man, I feel it. You feel it like this every day. I mean, I feel like Beast part. Boy and I am Beast Boy every day, but today I'm even more Beast Boy. It looks good. I got the fresh Beast Boy kicks. Ooh, uh, fire! I got the fresh Beast Boy cosplay. Ding, uh, ding, ding! Fire! And we here at San Diego Comic Con. We about to have some fun. Oh my Meet God. me down there at Hall B, and we're gonna cruise around together. Fire! AMC, I love you. Thanks for be. transforming me, yo. Yes, now, like we said, outside of Hall B, we're gonna be hanging out. Take pictures with Beast Boy, the Beast Boy. This yeah, is actually yeah. him. This is a very exciting That's time. That's right. I'm right here. This is him. He's this is right me. Here. All Beast right. Boy. We're gonna say goodbye from all of us here at AMC Theaters and Greg Sipes. Big thank you to Amber and Kenneth. Get over here, guys. Yeah, thank you for making nice me look so waves. fresh. Yeah, it's been a really awesome stream. We can't wait to see you guys at Comic-Con with all of the Teen Titans and also the premieres today at noon and two, if you can get there. But I think we should end this stream by singing Waffles. Waffles, 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 Waffles. waffles. See you waffles, guys at Comic-Con. I'll see you at the AMC theaters after the Teen Titans go to the movies, yo. Waffles, uh. waffles, 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 waffles. waffles, waffles, waffles. waffles, waffles.